Dennis Quaid has been in practically everything and he's currently starring in Netflix's new film, Blue Miracle. Earlier, we spoke to Dennis all about it and asked him what being married to someone 39 years younger is like. Here's today's Chatting with the Stars. Do you see anybody on this list that's won the black and blue twice? Do you? Well, there's me. Dennis Quaid, welcome to DBL. We're so excited to talk about Blue Miracle. It's based on an incredible and inspirational true story. Welcome to DBL and tell us more about it. It is uh, an incredible, unbelievable true story. If this was a piece of fiction, the movie would not have been made because it's impossible to believe, but it was true. These kids in this orphanage, they were about to lose their orphanage uh, in Casa Hogar in Mexico. And there was this fishing tournament that they do every year. Uh, it's the biggest fishing tournament in the world, really, with the biggest prize uh, down at Cabo. You and three of your least annoying orphans will be on my boat for the competition. When I catch the winning fish, we'll split the earnings. These kids, along with this salty captain with a boat that was about to be scuttled, went out and won this tournament and uh, saved their orphanage, you know, and changed their lives and lives of the captain. And it's beautiful to see things like this. We have, a, we have enough of bad stories that come out. This is uh, one for the good guys. We all need I this right now in our lives. We all need it. I love it. What was your yeah. favorite part about playing that uh, salty Captain Wade that you just mentioned? Was it fun Arr. to be a little angry? <laughs> <laughs> Didn't have to take a bath for two weeks. That was great. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this was a guy, who, you know, this really changed his life. It was a great character to play. As a history nerd, I have to ask you this question because this is really cool. You have an upcoming role as President Reagan, which how has this role not been done yet? I mean, this is, I mean, in terms of yeah. how he fits into our nation's history, I mean, this is going to be uh, huge. Uh, what does the show Pawn Stars have to do with your movie coming out in 2022? <laughs> I, Reagan. I, I like, just saw. Please that episode. explain that. <laughs> yeah. you know, I'm a big fan of that show going way back, actually. Give it a memento of, of Reagan's life wow. doing that. That was a lot of fun to do. But uh, Reagan was like maybe the most challenging role I think I've had in my career. For one thing, he was my favorite president. I mean, he's an icon. I'm really looking forward to it. So are we. I think we. that's going to be huge. And we also heard that the pandemic didn't stop you and your new bride, Laura, from getting married last year. Congratulations. Yeah. Yes. So uh, thank you very much. In fact, our anniversary is coming up next week. We uh, just went up to Santa Barbara. Ooh, mm. I it, love me yeah. some Santa Barbara. It was a great thing to do, especially in the middle of the pandemic. Gives you faith in the future. True, <laughs> but being tucked in with uh, your new bride, did it help or hurt your marriage? And having a 39-year age difference, you guys ever notice it? I think it helps. Not only that, uh, our kids went on our honeymoon with us. Actually, we, we, took, we took a car trip to, uh, to Montana. And uh, so everybody got to know each other really well. Real well. And, uh, you know, in the end, it was a little bit like vacation to the movie, end, but everybody got to know each other really well. And it was all good in, in the end. It made us closer. Oh, I love hearing that. DBL Nation, definitely don't miss this heartwarming story. Blue Miracle on Netflix now. Dennis Quaid, thank you so much for chatting today, and thanks for stopping by. We appreciate you. Thanks, Dennis. Thank you.